We're live in Salford for a TV first. It's Boris Johnson versus Jeremy Corbyn. So the first TV debate of the 2019 general election has just finished. So who won? Well, the answer is nobody particularly. The whole event had the feel of a zero-sum game to it. Neither candidate to be the UK's next prime minister scored any particular point or made headway in their campaigns. Both brought out generic sound bites we've heard many times before. And I know you're not want me to say this, but we so, need to get no, Brexit no, done. <laughs> They didn't engage in any proper debate about policy or any arguments that moved the campaign forward. Can you rule it out in that nine years of chaotic coalitions Can, already. Okay. The first half of the debate, hosted on ITV on Tuesday evening, was dominated by Brexit. That was much more comfortable territory for Boris Johnson, who has his clear slogan of getting Brexit done by January the 31st, before moving on to other domestic priorities. He managed to win applause from the crowd with his message there and his attacks on his rival, who still hasn't said how he wants Brexit to be resolved. We still don't know, by the way. Uh, what he proposes to okay. do, nor whether he is in favour right. of it or against All it. Right. Jeremy Corbyn's policy is to have another referendum and let the British people decide if they want to stay in the EU or leave with his deal. And he was attacked repeatedly by Boris Johnson for that matter. We will have a referendum, we will have negotiation and we will abide by that result. After the break, things moved on to the NHS, which is more comfortable territory for the Labour leader. And yes, he did manage to get some good points scored about the privatisation of the health service and cuts under the Conservative government. You're going to sell our national health service out to the United States and the Father. But the attacks were blunted by Mr Johnson's promise of more cash and new, more hospitals. So where does this leave the campaign? This is really the beginning of the 2019 general election campaign. It's been rather slow so far with not much movement from either side. But Boris Johnson is a clear 10 to 15 points ahead from Jeremy Corbyn and the Labour leader needed to get some momentum tonight and he didn't find it. He didn't score any blows, he didn't get any big applauses. So in the matter of this campaign, it feels like Boris Johnson might have just about emerged on top.